The Count of Monte Cristo by Alexander Dumas is a classic tale of revenge, betrayal, and redemption set against the backdrop of early 19th century France. At its core, the novel explores the consequences of unchecked ambition, the corrupting influence of power, and the enduring strength of the human spirit. The narrative follows the journey of Edmond Dantes, a young and ambitious sailor who is falsely accused of treason and imprisoned in the notorious Chateau d'If. Betrayed by those he considered friends, Dantes languishes in captivity for fourteen years, his innocence slowly giving way to bitterness and a thirst for vengeance. Central to the novel's theme is the transformation of Edmond Dantes into the enigmatic and vengeful Count of Monte Cristo. Emerging from his imprisonment with a newfound wealth and knowledge, the Count embarks on a meticulously planned quest for retribution against those who wronged him. Through his elaborate schemes and manipulations, he exposes the hypocrisy and moral decay of French society, exacting his revenge with cold precision. However, as the Count's elaborate revenge unfolds, Dumas delves into the moral complexities of justice and redemption. While Dantes initially revels in his vengeance, he gradually confronts the moral ambiguity of his actions and the collateral damage inflicted upon innocent bystanders. This internal conflict reflects the novel's broader exploration of the human capacity for both good and evil, as well as the consequences of yielding to base desires. Throughout the narrative, Dumas skillfully weaves together themes of love, loyalty, and betrayal. The relationships between characters such as Dante's, his beloved Mercedes, the loyal Haiti, and the treacherous Fernand highlight the intricacies of human emotions and the enduring power of forgiveness. Despite the injustices they face, characters grapple with their own flaws and seek redemption in various forms, ultimately underscoring the novel's underlying message of hope and resilience. Furthermore, the Count of Monte Cristo serves as a critique of the aristocratic society of post-Napoleonic France. Dumas vividly depicts the opulence and decadence of the Parisian elite, contrasting it with the stark poverty and suffering of the masses. Through the character of the Count, who navigates both worlds with ease, the novel exposes the inherent inequalities and injustices of the social order, ultimately advocating for a more just and equitable society. In addition to its thematic depth, Dumas's masterful storytelling and intricate plot twists captivate readers from start to finish. The novel's richly drawn characters, vivid descriptions, and suspenseful narrative drive propel the reader through its labyrinthine plot, culminating in a satisfying conclusion that reinforces the triumph of justice and the enduring power of the human spirit. In conclusion, The Count of Monte Cristo stands as a timeless masterpiece that continues to resonate with readers around the world. Through its exploration of themes such as revenge, redemption, and the human condition, Alexander Dumas crafts a gripping tale that transcends the bounds of time and place, leaving an indelible mark on the literary landscape.